you look here on the whiteboard, I've drawn a straight line here that goes from your birth through your life and to death. And this straight line is what I will define as destiny. When we're following our destiny, when we're living out our purpose, life seems to be full of these beneficial coincidences, these lucky experiences. Everything seems to go right and we find meaning and happiness in life. If you depart from that, if you start to make choices that are out of alignment with your purpose, which is what I have here as a sine wave, this is free will. And free will can get us into trouble sometimes because we make choices that just aren't in harmony with, with what we're here for. And when this happens, there's a, a corrective action that takes place. We start to experience a breakdown or things start to seem to fall apart. Things go wrong. We find ourselves unfulfilled and wanting for more. And I, I believe that this corrective action is the universal intelligence, the higher intelligence, telling us that we need to get ourselves back onto this path, that we need to walk that straight and narrow, the razor's edge, that we need to start getting back to the basics of our purpose, our meaning in life. And I believe that we all have a destiny, we all have a purpose. The universe has plans for you. You know, what is fulfillment in life? You know, we have uh, all of these ideas that our culture poses to us about success, that it takes money, it takes beauty, power, and all these things make a, a successful life. So I would suggest to you that all of these things are fine in and of themselves, but they don't really get down to the bare basics of what makes a fulfilling and happy life. And I believe that the, the key element that was missing in her life was that she wasn't following her destiny. She hadn't found her purpose.